The one drill that's gonna fix your entire golf swing. How do you stay in posture? Swinging the golf club on plane, stopping coming over the top, stop your slice, working the body correctly, this has you covered. And all you're gonna need is a wall. So let's get over here and put the nice bright green hat on, especially for you, okay? So we're gonna stand in here, and in order to do this drill, we're gonna build it from the feeling here, and then we're gonna hit some shots as well. So there's gonna be two parts to this. I think it's important that you do watch both parts because a lot of you will be able to do this against the wall, but building into a shot, it's a little bit hard, and we'll talk through how we do that. So grab your golf club, just shot the head, put the rest of it up your left hand side. What I want you to do is, I want you to get it so your head's just gonna touch the wall. Forgive me everybody, I'm gonna turn my hat backwards here, just so you can see that my head's touching the wall throughout. So my head's on the wall, I've got nice good posture, I'm not too bent over, I'm not stood too close to it. I want you to get into good golf posture and just shuffle into the wall until your forehead or top of your head's just touching it here. So what I want you to feel is here, is that we create a good takeaway. Golf club stays on the side of the body. We then set the golf club up towards the bottom of the wall. We turn it to the top, keeping the head on the wall, nicely in posture. Bring the golf club down, head on the wall still. As you can see here, the golf clubs come from the inside or relatively neutral plane. Into impact, head's on the wall, bring it through. So that would be our perfect model. That would be our perfect model. What I want you to do is I want you to see this again. We're gonna show you from the face down the line perspective as well. Forgive me with the hat, guys, I'm sorry. So if I'm stood here now, over the top, I'm gonna to collide in. If I'm standing up in the backswing, coming down the way down, we can clearly get a good feeling for what is wrong. So jump over this side. We'll move this out the way for you as well. Let's do the same thing here. So again, this is what it looked from the down the line perspective. Head just, just off the wall. Position one, club head is working on an arc around the body. So it stays on the wall, comes off the wall. Club head first parallel. Set the golf club nice flat lead wrist. Move to the top. Start our down swing. Move it in. Let the head come off and around. Showing you that aspect again, if you're coming over, we're gonna collide straight into the wall. If we're standing up, our butt end of the club is gonna hit the wall. If we're a golfer who likes to get this arms working out and the club head working around, we're gonna hit the wall. So you can get some really valuable feedback for how to get our golf swing working correctly. So this is the second part to this, and this is sort of like the eureka moment. The eureka moment, because it's all well and good, I think, is having drills like this, having feelings, but a lot of us find it hard to bridge that feeling into a shot. So how can we do that? This is how I want you to do that. It's gonna sound quite left field this when I say this. I want you to stand, address the golf ball, move just off it, and close your eyes. I want you to picture that wall, because as soon as we close our eyes, we're gonna feel similar things to what happens there. We can't rely on our arms and our eyes to sort of make those accountabilities for ourselves. We have to swing in balance, in posture, because if we don't, we stand up, we're gonna fall over, the eyes are closed, over, the eyes are closed, we're gonna fall over. So eyes closed, just swing it back, bring it down, bring it through, pose and hold that finish. And it's amazing how your movements will become quieter. And what I mean by quieter is more organized. If we're not quiet, fresh movements, we're throwing this club, we're pulling these arms down, we're colliding into the wall. I don't describe them as quiet movements. Quiet movements to me is that feeling of the golf club. One, two, three, four. And honestly, I've done this with a lot of people. I've also got people to do this one-handed, not necessarily closing their eyes. If they didn't like the closing the eyes, we do it one-handed. And again, they all start to organize their movement better because their body has to react better. When you've got both hands on the golf club, this is now light relative to you. One hand on, yes, it's still light, but it's a lot heavier relative to you now because only one hand on the golf club. So the other variation for this would be, in, 
through and you could even do it one handed on the wall. So taking this from a concept, you can do it at home and please do, if you're doing this at home right now, get against that wall. Video yourself, I mentioned this in a couple of days ago video. Video yourself from the down the line perspective with the head on the wall. Video yourself from the face on perspective with the head on the wall. You're really gonna see yourself move better in golf swing and fix a lot of those common problems. This is, the, this is the fix you've been searching for. This is it. So here's it one away now. And we'll show you what sort of my fix looks like on here. I've got a video coming up soon on the channel. It's about me having my golf lesson. So let's show you. I've been doing a little bit of practice. And uh, we'll just show you briefly what stage we're at. And how you can take this drill as well. And what angles you should be videoing it from. Right, let's have a little look to see what's happening. So what do we think of this? This is just a simple feeling. I've got the concept of my head on that wall, got the concept of everything working nice and quiet. A little bit of an update on my swing. There will be some more of this video coming out soon. But yeah, try this drill, try this concept. And I really think you can start to fix some big ailments in your golf swing. Head on the wall, down the line perspective, camera at hand height, floor to ceiling, hand height, left to right in position as well, face on, down the line, get those videos sorted and analyze them yourself. You're gonna really enjoy the aspects of this drill.